some of the properties of this snake, I mean, if you ever bitten by the snake, is that it's uh, coagulation problems. And what I mean by coagulation problems is that you start bleeding from all offices of the body. So from the gums, uh, from the rectum, uh, from, uh, from uh, all offices of the body, including all wounds. And this is a snake that never keeps forgiving. Its envenomation rate is probably 98%. So now this snake doesn't dry bite. It doesn't dry bite, very seldom. When it, when it bites, it bites with full envenomation, right? Now, I understand that you also were bitten by Russell's viper less than seven, eight months ago. You were envenomated and you fainted. How, how, how quickly? Three minutes. Okay, and how many vials of antivenom did it take to sustain you? Uh, 32 vials. 32 vials of antivenom for this. And the snake was probably the same size, right? Okay, and uh, what are the manifestations did you have? Did you have hematuria as a result of the bite? Did you have any neurological dysfunction, like, for example, uh, difficulty in the eyelids and the process? You did, you did have a little bit of neuro, neurological symptoms with it. And what about hemoglobinuria, where you passed a pink urine? You did. Do you have any damage with your kidneys as a result? I mean, from your medical records? No. No. Okay. No signs. Okay. And uh, how long did your did your symptoms last you for? I mean, for example, did you have problems with bending your hand as a result of the injury? You did. About three months. Wow. Wow. And uh, were there any other symptoms that you that you uh, did you have any muscle aches and pains as a result of it of the venom? You did. You did. Right. So you were administered with 32 vials of antivenom from this snake. This is one of the most significant snakes for agricultural workers. This snake is considered to be an agricultural hazard. So with the creation of Animal Venom Research International's new polyvalent antivenom for Sri Lanka, no antivenom is currently available for this snake that is species specific. The current antivenom from India, from Vince and Bharat is made for the Indian subspe subspecies of the Russell's Viper. And as a result of that, Large doses of antivenom has got to be administered in Sri Lanka because it doesn't apply to Sri Lankan snakes. So with the creation of AVRI's new project in Sri Lanka, we are creating a brand new antivenom for this country uh, that is going to be species specific and regional specific for the island. And that's the reason why we as AVRI have come here, is to do a search and discovery and identification of areas so when we'll be collecting the snakes for our field studies. Sanat Viraratna is a key member of the Animal Venom Research International team. He is my curator of all our snakes or, or, uh, on this project. He is the uh, gentleman in charge of all the husbandry. And he's the only one that I trust in taking care of these snakes because these snakes could mean the difference between life and death. And a bite from one of these snakes could be very fatal. So thank you very much. And I wanted to thank Sanat for sharing his knowledge about the Russell's Viper of Sri Lanka. And uh, thank you, Sanat, for everything.